So today we have a huge punch list to finish on this really cool house that we're building for a special client. And it has a lot of cool features like solar, a bed that goes up and down. So let's go inside, I wanna show you a few things. So a lot of the cool things in this house have yet to be installed. But one of the things we're doing is, this is gonna be a bed that will raise up into the ceiling and it's all controlled by a switch. And what's cool about that is the bed can either go all the way up, it can be a little bit down, but you can have two queen size bunk beds basically, or just one queen bed, whatever you'd like. This is gonna be the eat-in table area. Underneath this, we've got a lot of storage. This is a full compartment that's accessed from both sides. So you can put your snowboards, your skis. We've got drawer storage and flip storage. And we also have tons of countertop space and refrigerator, cooktop, a big sink. Doors on this unit are all pop open. They'll latch, everything just pops open. This is a garbage can. So it does not pop open or shut but all the other drawers definitely do. I've been working tirelessly on this solar setup here. Basically, we had to fit all these batteries. These are lithium ion 48 volt batteries. We got a 3600 watt inverter, solar controller that controls five solar panels on the roof, and it's all controlled with this, in, this, uh, this right here. Which, uh, I haven't read the manual yet, but you can go through all the different functions of everything that has to do with the solar in this house. So it's kind of cool. And then there'll be cabinet doors that close this off and you'll never know it's there. On the other side, tucked underneath this cabinet, is we have a 100 gallon water storage for fresh water. So this unit is 100% off the grid. We've got storage tanks below. The bathroom's cool because the back wall is on an angle. So with a 20 foot trailer, we're able to make this feel a lot bigger in here by pushing this wall out on an angle. And we got enough room for a vanity sink, 36 inch shower. Customer wanted a composting toilet, so we put a separate, it's a really fancy compost toilet. But underneath it, we have your hookup in case you wanted to just change this out to a regular RV toilet as well. Again, tons of storage, cabinet tree, shelves. One of the nice things I like about this unit is the different contrasts in the ceiling. So we went with white shiplap on the walls and a dark ceiling where you'd have uh, dark walls and a light ceiling. We want to do the opposite there. We want this thing to look very different. This is a really cool window. So if you wanted to serve people, maybe their drinks or whatever, or maybe you want to use this as a concession stand style unit and have this as be your prep kitchen. You can serve people right outside. You've got this to protect against rain so you can keep this open. It's a nice feature. This window just shuts like so. All the windows on this unit are awning windows so you can leave them open during the rain. Well that's about it. Don't forget to like, comment, share this video. If you have any comments or concerns or questions for this house leave them in the comments and we'll see you next time.